In this video, we're going to see if ChatGPT can script a Roblox game in 10 minutes. So the game we're going to be creating today is a simple obby game. Here are the challenges for ChatGPT, and we're going to see if ChatGPT can create the game in 10 minutes. Let's go ahead and start the timer. The timer is going, let's open ChatGPT. I'm in ChatGPT right now, and let's see if we can get the game made in 10 minutes. So first on the list is leader stats. Can you script Roblox leader stats with a number stat called stage to count players stages in my obby? game. The AI is thinking, let's go ahead and see what it writes. As you guys can see, we're about a minute into the challenge and it's telling us exactly what to do. Let's see how this goes. Alright guys, I'm gonna have to stop ChatGPT because what it's writing right now is actually incorrect, so I'm gonna restart it. Can you make a Roblox leader stat script with a stage stat to count player stages? Let's go ahead and see what the AI can do. We're almost two minutes into the challenge and the AI still hasn't created its first script. Let's see what happens. It's using local player and this only happens in local scripts, not server scripts. This means we're we're not going to be able to save the player stages. So I'm going to ask it, can you rewrite this in a server script? Let's go ahead and see what ChatGPT says. Unfortunately, guys, it's doing the same thing again. And this means ChatGPT is already failing its first obstacle. So what's happening right now is that it's creating a local script. So guys, we're almost three minutes and 30 seconds in. I'm going to ask it to make it a server script. Guys, I just asked it to make it a script I can put in server script service. Let's go ahead and see what it writes. There we go, guys. We're about four minutes in, but now it's finally creating the script properly. I don't need all of this code down here right now, so I'm just going to go ahead and copy this. Let's create a new script in server script service and paste in the code. Looks like the code is working. Let's go ahead and move on to the next challenge. So completed leader stats. Let's go ahead and see if we can save these leader stats now. Guys, about five minutes left. Let's go ahead and see what ChatGPT can do. I just asked ChatGPT if it can write a script that saves the player's stage value and loads it when they join. Let's see what ChatGPT can do. It's been like 15 seconds and it finally got started. This is why I love this AI, guys. What it's doing is checking if we already have leader stats and if we don't, it's creating them for us. I'm going to go ahead and copy this script and paste it in. I just created a brand new script. Let's go ahead and name it data and now I'm going to open up game settings and make sure that I enable the studio access to API services. I'm going to copy this error that the data script is giving us and see what ChatGPT says about it. Guys, there's about two minutes and 40 seconds left. Let's go ahead and see what ChatGPT says about the error. Looks like the AI has apologized for its error. Let's go ahead and see what it does. That's amazing, guys. It knows it can't use these functions on the player object, and now it's going to be creating it on the data store object. Guys, there's only about two minutes left. As soon as this is done, I'm going to copy the code and paste it in as fast as I can. Guys, looks like it's done doing what it really needs to, so I'm just going to go ahead and copy this one. Let's go ahead and paste the code in and hit play. Guys, I just pasted the code in, but looks like it's looking for a function called update state. Maybe it's in the script that I just deleted. As we can see, the function is right here. Let's go ahead and take it and move it up. I'm going to move this code down and paste it in right here and hit play. Looks like we're getting the error again. Let's see what's happening. Guys, I'm going to go ahead and copy this code and paste it in. Inside the data script, I'm just going to paste in the code and hit play. Looks like it did work in my stages one. I'm going to go ahead and change it and see what happens. I'm going to set my stage to two and leave the game. Now let's join back and see what happens. I'm back and it looks like it didn't save the stage. Unfortunately, guys, with 10 seconds left, I'm going to declare this challenge a fail. ChatGPT couldn't get past the second stage and it barely got past the first. ChatGPT is a great resource if you want to learn how to script, but it's not great when it comes to really scripting. If you guys do really want to learn how to script, the video on your screen right now goes over exactly how I would learn scripting if I were to start from zero. If you guys really do want to learn scripting, check that video out. Otherwise, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.